Hey guys, welcome to our channel. In this guide, we will show you how to fix a Poco M3 that is stuck on a black screen of death and won't respond. When a smartphone gets stuck on a black screen and won't turn on, the problem can just be a minor firmware issue, as long as it's not caused by hardware damage. In fact, you may only need to do one or a couple of procedures to fix this. With that being said, here's what you should do. First solution, force reboot your Poco M3. If there are no visible signs of hardware damage, then your Poco M3 may have powered off due to a firmware crash. That's something you can fix by doing the forced restart. So if your device just won't respond for some reason, here's what you need to do. Press and hold the power key for 10 seconds or more. This will trigger it to boot up. When the logo shows, release the power key and allow the device to continue the boot process uninterrupted. Most of the time, this is the only thing you need to do to make a phone respond again. However, if this procedure fails, then move on to the next solution. Second solution, try to boot into the recovery mode. There are times when the firmware won't load or respond. However, it's important for us to know if your phone is still capable of turning on. So try starting it up in recovery mode and if it actually does power on, then it means there's no issue with the hardware. Here's how it's done. Press and hold the volume up button and the power key for 10 seconds. If the POCO logo shows, release both keys and wait until the device enters the recovery mode. From here, you can just reboot your phone by pressing the power key to select the options. If your POCO M3 boots in recovery mode, then it should reboot normally. However, if it still won't respond to this procedure, then try the next solution. Third solution, charge your phone and do the forced restart. If your POCO M3 failed to respond after doing the first and second solutions, then what you have to do next is charge it and do the forced reboot while it's charging. It's possible that the battery was drained and the firmware crashed just before the device powered off. So here's what you should do. Plug the charger to a working wall outlet. Connect your phone to the charger using the appropriate cable. Regardless of whether your POCO M3 shows the charging sign or not, leave it connected to the charger for at least 5 minutes. Now while the device is still connected to the charger, press and hold the power key for 10 seconds or more. If the logo shows, release the power key and it should boot up successfully. However, if this doesn't fix the problem either, then you have to let a technician check the device for you. There's probably an issue with the hardware. We hope that this troubleshooting guide can help you. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and make sure you enable the notifications so that you'll be notified when we publish new videos. Thanks for watching.